23 ABC's digital update is brought to you by West Medical. Good evening, I'm Alex Bell. Here's what's making headlines. Kern County Fair officials say the fair could return this fall, although it will be a little bit different from years before due to the COVID-19 pandemic. We reached out to the fair board and they confirmed they are currently planning this year's fair. With the fair set to return from September 22nd until October 3rd. A representative for the fair is saying their biggest focus is making sure that local youth livestock exhibitors have an in-person show this year. As you may remember, a livestock show, all livestock shows, excuse me, were virtual last year. The representative saying this year's fair will be much smaller with the top priority being safety for all of those who want to take part. Currently, the fairgrounds are being utilized as a mass COVID-19 vaccination site. Meanwhile, today, the Edwards Air Force Base broke ground on a $34 million joint simulation environment facility. The 72,000 square foot facility is projected to bring 50 jobs to the base in the fields of computer science, engineering, cybersecurity, electronic engineering, technologies, and logistics. The project will provide a state-of-the-art modeling and simulation environment and high-end advanced training and tactics development for its warfighters. And today is National Drink Wine Day, and according to nationaldrinkwine.org, the idea is to promote love and health benefits of wine. Fermented grapes have been a part of human existence for thousands of years and have played an important role in history, religion, and relationships. Wine has also been known to reduce some risks of heart disease and enhance food and life, of course, in moderation. Looking at some beautiful weather as we head into our Friday. Big area of high pressure developing, strengthening. We'll have a good chance of get, getting close to 70 degrees with plenty of sunshine tomorrow. Then as we head into Saturday, early in the day, this cold front will move through and that's going to bring us some changes. But let's get into the details of tomorrow's forecast first because again, it does look excellent. 70 or high in Bakersfield, 67 in Delano, 66 in Taft. A little bit cooler in the mountain communities, but parts of our desert getting close to 70 as well. Really nice with all that sunshine. But we are cooler on Saturday behind that front breezy or two. A couple of showers here and there. High temperature 60 degrees for Saturday. But we're right back, back on track as we head into Sunday. And then really nice as we start out next week. Back to some 70s. We'll see some 70s in the Kern River Valley by the time we get to next week as well. And even the second and half of the weekend looking good. Just that cold front on Saturday bringing some changes. And that's your latest update. Have a good evening.